Darren, how do you reflect on that? God, can okay, absolutely God after such a fine performance the other day to come here to a place like Livingston. No disrespect, where, where I think we should be winning, and uh, we've retired with a meek performance. It's very disheartening. Uh, felt that we were never really in the game. They bossed it, and that's that really hurts to go away uh, with that with that result. I mean, it was a, a horrible day to play football, but I presume that's that's no excuse. No, I mean, listen, we know Livingston's strengths and pl- the play to it. I think we maybe try to match them a bit, a bit too much with what, what they normally do with long balls and whatnot. We never really got into the groove and played their own game. Uh, and again, two sort of sloppy goals that we lost. So it ends the year on a bit of a low note, to be honest, which is very frustrating. Is that part of the disappointment that it takes the shine off uh, an unbelievable performance and result on Boxing Day? Of course it does. I mean, we go for a massive high coming into a game where history will tell you it's, it's a difficult fixture. Uh, we just never really turned up. Nobody turned up, so it's very disappointing. But it's easy for me to say that now. Standing in here with you guys, we should have done it in the park. That's the most frustrating thing. You've been out a long time. That's two two games in a week. How are you, how are you feeling? I feel okay. Yeah, I feel fine. I mean... Again, Astros probably no great, but I mean that's that's not an excuse. Both teams have to deal with. Uh, I'm just gutted that we lost, to be honest. It's been a lot happened at the, at the club in the last month or so. Maybe a chance now to get a breather and, and regroup. Hopefully, I mean, the gaffer says that we'll get get a couple of days off, and then we've got to go away. Uh, hopefully to Spain, and that'll be a lot of hard work and, and ball to really push for the second half of the season, which I think is needed.